All right, let's go take out plant 42. Ran into the wrong door, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Now you can do this from the game, man. You don't have to take me into this every time we do this. Oops. Oh, flame rounds. Forgot I was going to find those. <laughs> Wouldn't have uh, burned off my acid, uh, put my acid rounds in the thing if I remembered that. And I can't switch them out because reasons. Imagine the disappointment if I were playing as Chris and I opened the damn thing up. Track the key all the way across the place for that. And all of a sudden... Ooh. Oh shit, you know what? I needed the, uh, the red book. Where the hell's the red book? in one of those dormitory rooms. Might have been in this one. Nope, I'm being a dumbass. Can I open that chest? That desk? Yay, shotgun shells. Got quite a collection now. Gotta collect on them all. Yeah, that's it. I didn't pick it up because at the time I was thinking, oh, it's just a log. <laughs> I forgot about the book puzzle. Stupid me.
Yes. Secret door to get into a room that nobody should really bother trying to get into anyway. Gotcha. What the hell is this? Barry! Jill! It's not attached to its own root system. Don't mention it. What a monster. I can't believe... What the hell is this place anyway? Okay. I'm gonna stay in the soldiers' area and take a look around. Though I'm sure there are still things in that other mansion as well. Anyway, let's start searching separately. Start? Okay. You've been doing that the whole time. Except for the fact you seem to be following Jill around, though. Wesker. Jill, so you're safe. That's what I was going to say. Where on earth have you been? You disappeared from the hall all of a sudden. I'm sorry, but I have my reasons. Perhaps you guys have met them? It was all I could do to protect myself against those strange creatures. Is that right? Anyway, it's good to see you're safe. Jill, our first priority is to get out of here. Yes, you're right. Now, there are a lot of rooms in that mansion that we can't get into because they're locked up. I have been looking around for clues. Okay, I'll go to the other house and see if I can find any clues. Will you do that? I'm counting on you. Oh, he's not up to anything, you know? Ha! <laughs> yeah, of course, the, um... Let's see. Let's go and... ferry this crap back into here. Not gonna need any of this stuff for a while. It includes the pistol. Not gonna be using the pistol for a little while. I'm going to be relying mostly on the bazooka, or the shotgun. So I won't need any of this crap. I will need the mansion key, though. But there are a bunch of herbs in this area that I want to pick up. Because I'm not going to be returning to this area anymore. So I want to clean it out. That boss battle was another thing that might end up being more difficult for Chris than it will be for Jill. Jill has the option of going and mixing the J-Volt up herself and then applying it to the roots, and I guess that would make the boss fight easier. Chris doesn't have that option. Chris just has to go in and fight the thing right away. And it'll grab him just like it grabbed Jill. Then it'll go, and Rebecca will show up, and you have to go and 
Well, I guess maybe it's going to depend on what what choices you made earlier, perhaps. But you may end up having to play as Rebecca and Rebecca go and mix up the chemical while Chris is captured by its tentacles there. Uh, Barry just shows up with a flamethrower and toasts the damn thing. Another example of Barry being more helpful than Rebecca. <laughs> of course, the advantages that Rebecca has, like playing the piano or mixing the chemicals and all that kind of stuff, are a little bit unnecessary because Chris, uh, Jill can just do that shit herself. Probably unnecessary, but I'd rather grab the stuff and be safe, rather than sorry. Twenty-one shotgun shells. Let's get the rest of them here. It's not going to really hurt us to pick up the remainder of them. I've actually filled all of this up. I mean, I've had to put some effort into filling up the entire item box, but you can do it. Forty-nine and plus seven. So fifty-six shotgun shells. That's enough. Of course, I'm gonna switch over to the shotgun because the pistol's not gonna do us a lot of good for a little while because all of the monsters we're gonna have to be fighting for a little while are going to be hunters Try setting something on fire. How's that sound? I could pick these up later, because I will be in the area. But I'll grab them now. Now, this part really took me by surprise when I played the game the first time. Because I had just... Like, I was struggling through this. Because I didn't have any concept in the beginning of saving ammunition. I killed every damn zombie. I had a shit shot. So I was missing a lot. I was barely surviving. But then I get the mansion key. And I think, like, okay, you know what? Had all this trouble getting through the dormitory because... Well, it was full of zombies and there was fresh rooms and all that kind of stuff. But, like, okay, I go back to the mansion, and it'll be fine, because I cleared out most of the rooms. It'll be safe there. I was wrong about that. Somebody pushed that back to where it belonged. So I thought it was safe, and then this happens. I got through that area so much faster than I did. Ah! Pen 
an ass. Ah, she's fine. Now we got hunters everywhere. Gotta deal with them some bitches. Magnum ammunition. Don't need them now, but take them now and then we can use them later. Not going to need this for quite a while. make our way to the item room. Of course, there are hunters in here. Of course, the shotgun's gonna work better at close range than it will at long range. Barry apparently got back here before we did and put shit in here. So, thanks, Barry. Shit, um, should I? I think I can fight the snake now. If that's the case, I'm gonna want to prep for that. I think I can fight the snake now. I know it's a loading screen, and it, with the doors it does kind of add suspense, with the stairs it just looks silly. Hey, like me now, bitch! Ah, she'll be alright. Well, that happened. Dude, why are you always here? Jill, have you found anything interesting? Yes, but I can't see very well. How about going down to check by yourself? I have a rope here. 
Oh, do you? Well, then I'll try to go down using the rope. Oh my Wait. god, the dialogue. Hey, what's going on? Now I've done it. Sorry, Jill. Wait, I'll go and get another rope. Or she could throw that one back up Barry? to you. Barry? <sighs> Dumbass. This music is so stupid. Ah, oh, zombies. Alright. I guess I should have brought the pistol, but... Whatever. I'll one-shot these bastards. There's shells down here, anyway. Yep, 21 minutes. <laughs>